In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily make your Facebook profile private. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes and of course do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys. So let's get started and first off open up Facebook app and then right here tap at menu. After that hit add gear icon to open up settings and that's where you can easily find the privacy checkup. Just tap on it. You will be taken to this page where you should tap at who can see what you share. Then tap at continue and right here at the first step you will be able to choose who can see your contacts information including your phone number, email, birthday, hometown, current city and all that stuff. To hide some sensitive information you can tap at that drop down and change it from whatever is selected to only me. Once you've done with that, hit add next. On that step you will be able to choose default audience for your posts on Facebook. You can hit right here and then select to public, friends, friends accept or if you want to hide your posts from everyone you can select only me. And the same about stories. Also, if you want to limit your past posts, you can hit add limit and this will change who can see past posts that were public or friends of friends to only friends. Just keep in mind that anyone tagged in these posts and their friends may still see them. To limit past posts, hit add limit and then limit one more time. After that hit add next and on that step you will be able to block someone. So if you block some user they will no longer be able to see your posts, tag you, invite you to events or groups, start a conversation with you or add you as a friend. To add someone to your blocked list just hit right here. Then just search for uh, some user in that way and then just hit add block button next to username and then hit add block and after that you will be able to add to your block list as many users as you want after that hit add next and basically that's it now you can write down in the comments below if you have any questions about the tutorial hit the like button if you like that video and I see you in the next one